Alright, so we actually do have the little Magmar's Yoshi. Now, I have played this match in friendlies with Jake. A little bit. I know, um... Jake has beaten Elvikins before. However, I know he suffers a, a recent loss, just like me. I don't think Legit's Little Mac is anywhere near the caliber of Elvikins. I think this was uh, not the best decision. And then there goes the stock. But I also, I, I also applaud him for, for trying stuff out. Yeah, this is like dino food. Little Mac did not kill the dinosaurs. That was DDD. I thought we were gonna see some like sort of janky like first hitbox thing. Oh, he's got a KO punch. And GG. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, save that picture somewhere. Save that somewhere. Save that. Save that. That's going everywhere. That's going confessions. That's going that's going every every group chat, every reaction, every post. You know, everywhere. Look at that man! That's so good! It says so many things! That's Moomin Rider! Oh my god! Oh my god! Alright, we got game two. Wario is the pick. I think this is also. I encourage you for experimenting. I also think this is a bad pick for this Jake. Jake grew up with Wario his entire brawl career. Uh, I don't think he struggles with it in this game either. What's up? How much? How's it going? Pretty good. We're just, just trying a whole bunch of characters. Where is he now? But you know, to his credit, is Wario is working right now. As of this moment, he has a 3% lead. I figured. And now it's not working anymore. All right, well, rip that. Trying to find a new character. Yeah, now no, it's working. It's close. Mm -hmm. And when you're close to Wario, that's hella scary because he always has that laugh, just, just ready to rip on you. That's true. Die at 40. <laughs> Remembering like way back in like December of last year with like a uh, Nexus or whatever, who were bringing out the Wario 200%, wops the focus at 30%, yeah. he dies. God damn, rip focus. So sad to see. He was still Focus back then. <laughs> Focus, what a great name. And the Waft out of shield, that was good. But, but it wasn't it quite enough. He needed, the, he needed the higher charge of it. That was definitely a good option to go to. Mm. Are you kidding me? Well, I guess I have a jacket on, but. Uh, oh, well, that downer. Yeah. Downer, yeah. I was I, killed by that downer today. There are you now? Interesting. Didn't realize that had the potential to kill. I didn't either. Yep, gotta watch that shield. Yep. Oh, there he goes! Yeah, well, enough hits, and it'll do it, I guess. So, Firefly with a small lead right now. I legit needs to find a KO. If he doesn't need to find one, he can actually, like, take his time. He can use his time to like, get maybe a waft. Mm -hmm. But he doesn't want to get too much damage. Yeah, too much damage will be a big issue. He has all the time in the world right now. It's four minutes. You can do a lot of things in four minutes. You can make yourself some Chef Boy RD in four minutes. That's great. I would do that, too. Like, I got four minutes, let's go. And you know what? If you're really good, you can make, uh, you know, I have a special skill. Really? I can make minute rice in 58 seconds. Nice. Very impressive. All right. Well, yeah, Firefly just, like, not presenting any opportunities to, to get the KO. Mm, good up here, though. With Firefly, you really have to uh, get in his grill, and then the, the KO opportunities present themselves. Yeah, legit 24-7, he likes to shield a very lot. 
He likes it when people approach him, and Firefly doesn't exactly play that game all that much. Um, I feel like Yoshi, no, Jake definitely likes it when people approaches him. A lot of Jake's game plan, you see it in his Yoshi, you see it in his Robin. Uh, you'll see him uh, short hop backwards a lot. And what he's hoping you do is he's hoping you come in on the ground so he can uh, either do a, a forward air or an egg lay, depending on what he thinks you're going to do. So he, 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 he jumps away, kind of backs off the safety. But the problem with that strategy is that he'll often find himself in the corner and then he'll have like no stage control to really put any pressure. Mm -hmm. So there's pros and cons to that. And it's yeah. like, you see me a pit, right? Eventually he runs out of room and then you, like, you land a sweet dash attack. And it's sick. Yeah, with legit 1 over 7, he very much likes to control the pace of the game, I, I find. But he does it in his way, not in the sense of just like keeping all the pressure on. Mm -hmm. I find that, yeah, I find that when I fight him, and I fight him a lot, because holy crap. But he very often will stick in his shield when you're trying to come into him and try and, and, try and force a read out, out of you. And something like, for example, oh, I know he's going to grab tight here type of thing. Yeah. I'm going Donkey Kong. See the ideas. There, there's ideas in there. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they're not the best ideas, but you know, they're ideas. Like, this Donkey Kong is an idea. Will it be a good idea? Well, that's Personally, it. Personally, I don't... I, I, Jake told me that he was like beating uh, MTK's DK in friendlies. Mm -hmm. So I do think this is a bad idea. I've seen this matchup before. I also think that Jake is uh, not bad at all against heavy based characters like a DDD, a Bowser. Yeah, no, he's definitely uh, shown his prowess on that. Uh, I don't think le legit uh, Donkey Kong definitely isn't bad, but there's been a few noticeable like flaws in his game plan that I was able to notice in our set today, mm. for example. See which it. is why he forced the Diddy Kong. I forced the Diddy Kong switch. I feel, but you know it. It comes down to that the shield pressure. Like what I see here, he sticks his shield and he immediately looks for the grab, even though Firefly's already behind him at that point. Well, Firefly's all over him. He's running past the shield. He doesn't care. He doesn't respect this DK at all. Mm -hmm. He very he very much wants to get pressure out of the shield and use those aerial movements that Firefly is also good at to his advantage. But Firefly's just getting the better of him, and there you see a falling up air lands a stock. Shot. Both players are very strong in their own right, and legit, pr legit prowess on multiple characters is nice. I feel like if he just focused on one for at least like a month or something, he'd easily make her PR. It's PR is a weird thing. It's mm -hmm. you need to get wins. You you need to be consistent. Consistency is key. Yeah, legit's always consistent. I always see him making him out of pools. Oh, back throw. My, wow, smash throw, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, legit is definitely one of the more consistent players. He always seems to place around the same part each time. Always gets out of pools, always uh, lands up in the top 10 of a tournament. Yeah, no, he's, he hasn't really lost to like, anybody. Uh, he, he, honestly, he's just like, a little short. Mm -hmm. I think the, the thing he lacks are like really good wins. Because like, you got Bun Cake, right? Mm -hmm. It's 3-1 versus Uber and Jay. Those are pretty good. Right? Yeah. You have like... Uh... Oh, oh, the DK. Wow. He, I think you just got reverse Felix. You just, just got Felix. Yeah, okay. That was and that Donkey was, Kong working out. That was actually sweet sick though. M2K <laughs> Oh my M2K take notes. Yeah, I, I didn't even see that coming, honestly. I didn't see I mean he was all, you know, this Yoshi was all over this DK. Out of nowhere, just short hop forward air and it's sweet spots and just barely on the edge. God it's crazy. Damn. That is crazy. Uh, Firefly takes it immediately back to battlefield. Pretty much his favorite stage, I find. So, yeah. well, it's a very big stage, and uh, that's where he can get a lot of the uh, game plan going. Yeah. yeah, he lives. He lives forever. Yoshi's heavy. He takes a uh, takes advantage of that. On top of that, he sets up for so many juggles with the platforms with his up airs and his. Up -tilts. Oh, already gets the spike, but up tilt is actually so godlike for Yoshi, especially mm -hmm. on the stage. See, up yeah, tilt. He... You see where he's like from one up tilt. He's he's getting all this. Why is he using from the big one up tilt? Up -tilt. Yeah, there you go, yet another one you going. I mean? And he gets the down B, just catches legit as he drops his shield. When I play against Shake, if I get hit by up tilt, it's like, oh my god, I know it's coming. I know it's coming. Oh, and he just waits hey. with the up smash and catches Zero him at the very death. top. Perfect sock by Jake. See what he can do here. Oh. Up throw. Oh. Egg lays out, though. Oh, legit catches him with the back air, though. I will say, when you play multiple characters, it's important to keep them all practiced. Mm. Like, in your head, it's like, oh, I'll work on these, I'll work on these. It's like, no, you gotta, you gotta keep them all, all in the back pocket. 
You even if it's to that. Yeah. Even if it's just a bit of like for glory play every now and then. Yeah, absolutely. Just keep it keep it fresh, keep it good. Like, people always rag on for glory, but people don't understand, like, especially the characters which don't have like as complicated of inputs, similar to something like Captain Falcon or whatever. Like you can practice those on for glory even in like decently laggy environments and still have an idea of what you can do. You just need to not like fall for the for glory um mindsets that happen. Yeah. And just assume everyone's going to do X or Y. Uh, no, it's good for it's like you 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 have to expect like random stuff. You have to expect like tons of rules. You have to expect like stuff that's annoying to deal with and like go to for like maybe newer players. Mm -hmm. And it won't patch you off guard if you see someone like doing it. Yeah, definitely. But so. can't become reliant either. There's a balance. Ooh, try to get the jab forward smash, but legit getting to the ground fast enough to shield it. All right, tries to get the uh, falling up air. Won't do it. Battlefield helping uh, legit a bit there. I'll throw up air. Oh, but another falling up air, and that'll do, do it. it. Finally. Firefly will take it over legit 24-7 and move on to Grand Finals. Looks like we in there.